Welcome to Ring the Bell Combat TV. It's your boy Dan the Man. Anthony Joshua gets a brutal seventh round knockout against Robert Hellenius. This was a good win for Joshua, people. Yeah, it was a nice. It was a. It was about time he starts getting knockouts again, man. What's that? He ain't had a knockout win in over two years. So, um, it was a decent win. they will do a lot for his confidence, man. But, there's a but, yeah. I'm still not too convinced about AJ, man. Look, that was a decent win. Don't get it twisted. And Robert Hellenius ain't no mug. But Hellenius is also nowhere near the, you know, the top tier of the heavyweight division. Yeah. I mean, if Hellenius is in the top 10, then that's a sad state of affairs for the current heavyweight situation, man. I don't think Hellenius is in... He's in... Um, how can I put it? I won't call him a journeyman because he's faced top quality opponents. He's like Deontay Wilder and other fight, but, but I wouldn't. Yeah, he's not. He's not in my top ten. No, but he was able to touch Anthony Joshua up. Deontay Wilder got rid of him in one round. Yes, Styles make fights, but AJ was only able to get rid of him after he bust my man's nose. You know, bruised him up. And that's the scary bit. Because Hellenius is slow as fuck. If Hellenius can touch you up like that, bruise up your face like that, best believe Wilder can touch you up. Yeah. And we all know what happens when Wilder touches man up. He don't need to touch as much as Hellenius did. So that's the that's the that's where my concern is with AJ. You know, I like a lot of things that he's doing in there now. You can definitely see he's really worked on his skills. He's really worked on his defense, and he, he you know, he's trying to be a boxer. He's trying to be more of a boxer in there, but. I just don't think he's built like that. I really don't. I think uh, 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 AJ needs to, yes, be smart, but he, man, he still got to have that brutish, that I'm coming in there to knock a man out type of uh, uh, approach to fights, which I don't feel like he does anymore. He almost goes in there, I'm going to box. If the, if the KO comes, it comes. You know, the... The typical thing a boxer would say. Where someone like Wada, no, I'm coming in there to take you out. AJ is coming in there to box, and if he sees an opportunity, he will he will get rid of you. But I don't think that's that's in AJ's makeup. He's not built like that. He said himself he's not built for a 12 round fight. You know? He's not a 12 round fighter, but he's hey, only he knows, isn't it? But I'm not convinced with AJ, man. I'm really um, great performance. I can't you look, listen. I'm not knocking the guy. I'm just saying, if Robert Hellenius can bust your nose, give you a few black eyes, you've got a problem against someone like Deontay Wilder. I'm telling you. But anyway, you guys, let me know what you thought of the fight. And, uh, yeah, congratulations, Anthony Joshua. Well, now, we move on to Deontay Wilder, and we shall see. Anyway, it's been your boy, Dandaman, Ring the Bell Combat TV. Like, subscribe, share, and all that good stuff. Salute.